Well, well, well. <laughs> Another second video. Hopefully this doesn't uh, begin to be a new pattern in this channel. Because two videos a day, every single day, would just freaking kill me. But I just opened my PC in the morning and I had this advertisement from Steam. It's Capcom Arcade Studio. Okay, I moved back to the website. Um, so, it's Capcom Arcade Studio. Uh, I don't know exactly what those bundles mean. But you can like you can have different bundles of the game, and you ha you can have the free version. The free version is what I will be checking in a second, and I guess like let's see at least the first video. So I guess like the other uh, bundles will give you more games or more features like saving and stuff. To be honest, I don't know a lot of arcade games. I've never played an arcade game, like in arcades. And the oldest thing that I've played was Sega Genesis, and even then I didn't have a lot of games. But I'm hoping that this it's the 8 bit do one. Unfortunately, I bought the wrong one, not the Bluetooth that can pair wirelessly to PCs. But it's still kind of good. Hopefully, this will work with the arcade games because I've been waiting for so long to find another excuse to use this controller. Okay, I guess I, I, I think we understand. It has a bunch of old games. Let's just try the free version. Wait a second. So, there's the, like the. Indivisible for one dollar. Display frame. Okay, maybe those are like. Uh, I don't know. It looks like more cosmetic stuff, but I guess there are other games because I don't think somebody would buy a uh, forty-eight dollars, forty-nine almost. Well, not already, almost. $49 of cosmetics. Because, I don't know, that's kind of stupid. I don't know, let's, let's start, let's enter the game and see what it is about. At least the free version. Wait, wait a second, that was... Uh... The Resident Evil engine. <laughs> okay. I guess. I guess. That's kind of a very robust engine for so many old games, but I don't know. Okay, so as I said, I have this thing. And I get No. I guess this is type 1. Because type 2 is very different. Type 1. Do you want to connect to the network? Ah, I guess, yes, I don't know. Why would I need to connect to the network? Yeah, I'm signing off my soul to Capcom, that's very nice. Like, those are old games, why would I... Why would I need to connect to the network? Uh, start? Anything? Does not work. That's nice. <sighs> I guess I won't be using my favorite controller. My favorite favorite retro controller. Let's go to the Xbox One. Xbox One. One. I think this. Oh, the previous one was Xbox One, wasn't it? I don't know. I don't remember the Xbox names. Uh. Yeah, okay. So this one works immediately. Oh my god. So... What is this? Bionic Commando. 
9043. Select the game to change the ROM version. Okay. Forgotten Walls. I want to try this, Cyberbot. I think it's like a fighting game. Do you want to go to Steam Store? Uh, why would I want to do that? If you have purchased any downloadable content, it will become available after installation. Do you want to go to Steam Store? Nope. Steam Store? Nope. Steam Store? Nope. So 1943 is fr is free. So there are a lot of games that are blocked unless you buy them. But this one is free. Uh, R to insert coin. Here we go. To start, that's a very strange choice of weapons. Uh, Okay, I'm gonna play I guess all the games that are free here, because as far as I can see most of them aren't free. Oh, I can move. I can change the speed, I can move backwards, forwards. Ow, 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 ow. I, I like games like this. The first game that I encountered in this genre was was a uh, Space Chickens or whatever that was. I think the second one. Then I found this the the th first one, then the third, the fourth, and then they started to be not for free. Well, there were like demos for free, but I stopped playing them after a while because how many times you can finish the same demo. But the games were cool. I like them a lot. I was in... Uh, like... Was, what is it called? Elementary school? Yeah, I think I was in elementary school then. If that's the right name for whatever I'm trying to say. Okay. Alright, so... Uh, restart game, I guess. Yeah, restart game and then you go back. Okay, that's very strange. Okay, let's try Forgotten Walls. No. No. So, out of everything you have here, you can buy, uh, you can play for free only 9043. And it's an interesting game, it's a nice one, why not? But this is so disgusting from them to put this whole thing as a package to show you everything and then you need to buy them individually or buy as packs. I prefer so much more the Sega route, route that they did. You just like pay a certain amount of money and you have everything in that collection and that's it and yes you can do it here also in this collection but 
they kind of lure you in with the free version, which is only one game. Only one. That's it. You could have given like at least three of different types. Or at least like give people a trial demo of some of them. So they know if they want to play them or not. Yes, I know that most of the people that are interested in games like this have played them in the past. But there are people that, that are new to those type of game, types of games. Like I know some of the games here. I haven't played them though. And I would really like to. But I, I'm gonna stick with my Sega Genesis collection. I, uh, I don't know. I'm not gonna waste money on this. I have a lot of things to play either way. I'm not even buy I'm not even buying Biomutant because I have too many things to play. Yeah, I don't know. What about you guys? What do you think about this? Is this cool with you? Or do you prefer the direct approach? This costs this much. If you want to play, play. If you don't want to play, then you don't play. And not just give you a free game and like a bunch of arcades near it that you know you cannot access until you pay the money. I don't know. What? Yeah, what do you guys think? And of course, watch my other videos and everything. See you on the next one. Uh, second video, I guess. If you can call this a video. Bye-bye. <laughs>